All right, so hi there. This here we have is a just a plain canvas, 16 by 20. It's got a couple of layers of gesso on it. I sometimes just keep painting layers of gesso on it because you're not sure what to do. This thing has been sitting here staring at me for like the last two days. I was going to do this yesterday and I just didn't feel it. It got to it too late, and then it was like, I know it's going to take a while. Anyway, so, <clears throat> going to paint this. Let's see what happens. All right, so, what do we want to do here? Oh, yeah. Well, here, what is that? Yellow ochre. Always liked that one. It's fun sounding. It's a very fun sounding uh, color. Yellow ochre. Some white in there. Let's see what that does. See? Just put some stuff up there. Sometimes it's the first the first thing is the hardest one to do, right? And they say, you know, you should mix your colors. You don't want to just go straight up, but I've done that before. I like the straight up colors, but sometimes you just you know, if you want to do something different, right? You know, like I could just go with some scarlet red all by itself. I like the scarlet red. This one's one of my favorites of the colors. Just it's so red. It's so red. You know, but see that you know you can do that. But this is a mix of a bunch of colors. Some of those little yellows in there. I like that. <clears throat> you know, I like the paint knife. I mean, I've, you, you know me. I like my paint knife. So far, you've seen that a few times. And this guy likes his paint knife. You're darn right. Thanks that that Bob Ross guy kind of got me into this paint knife thing. Just feels so. I don't know what the right word is, but it's fun, right? Isn't it fun? Isn't it fun to play with paint? I mean, come on. Who's got a paint knife? You in there in the comments? Raise your hand if you got a paint knife and it's your favorite, one of your favorite things to play with. You, know, you got a big paint knife. I saw this guy. He's, I can't remember his name. He's good. He's, he's got some pretty cool stuff. He had it. His paint knife was big boy. It was kind of this shape, but it was like big. I was kind of jealous. <clears throat> I wasn't sure what to do with such a big paint knife. I saw one and was going to buy one, but... Yeah, maybe some other time. Again, it's one of those things like, like guys and their tools. <clears throat> dun, dun, dun. Guys and their tools. They keep buying tools. They're gonna buy some more tools. Yeah, I mean it's 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 in it that that's the one the Instagram. Oh, I'm addicted to this, right? <laughs> I'm addicted to this, right? <laughs> yeah, <he's sorry. laughs> so I'm just I don't know. I I sometimes just like to just start seeing what comes out, right? And just keep putting the colors in there. Sometimes you. Like, oh, you know, box that red in there. You know, sometimes you be sparingly. Sometimes I'm very sparingly. I have some stuff where it's like, this was, the, I'm like, oh, 
and done. Right? That was it. It sometimes feels like it's like I'm cheating, but sometimes you'll look at it and it's just like, wow, that has that right. It's just right. You know, it's got this, but this one's, you know, it's like, I just feel like there's something else. Like there's one, <clears throat> if you go on my, I think it's on my Instagram. It's called, it, it came from Kansas. I think that's what it was. <clears throat> it's from Kansas. I think that's what it is. Anyways, that one, that one like took like five minutes and it just kind of came cause it was just, the thing just kind of, it just did, it just came, it just came out of that. You're just sitting there and then, wow, that looked perfect and it's done. So, I mean, how does that feel? I mean, could you do that? Do you do that? Like when you're painting sometimes, do you feel like you feel like you just put two seconds worth of effort in there and you're like, wow, it's a masterpiece, right? You ever have that happen? just it's this labor of funness that exists with painting for me creativity it's like once I start doing it it's like oh. Let's see where that goes right isn't that kind of the whole point here we're supposed to be having fun do you have fun when you're just like doing stuff I mean, who knows? Maybe you got yourself a GoPro and you're gutted on your head and you're riding around on your mountain bike. Go post those videos. I legit love watching those videos where it's like these guys on their mountain bikes and they're like riding on the side of a mountain and you're like, oh my gosh, they're gonna die. And then they just drop in and then they go Brrr. like they go from the very top to the very bottom and you're just like, how did they do that? And someone like you do it, it take you like two or three hours. They do it in like 25 minutes. And you're just like, how did he do that? And what do you like to do? There's a lot of things that you could be doing. I mean, maybe you like painting. Maybe you want to do it. I mean, I'm doing it. Why not? Why not Zoidberg? Why not Zoidberg? It's an allergy thing. Tis that season. You know, sometimes I like to, you know, you just go like this with a brush in the paint. You just instead of like, you just, and then you just kind of get these little poochers on there. You know, see like this. This brush is fun because you kind of can come at it like this, like this, right? Boop, 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 boop. So, <clears throat> did you guys, what have you guys been doing with yourselves? Do you like to paint? Do you like to draw? You like to take pictures? What's your thing? What's your jam? What's your jam? I don't want that one. This one. What's the color? I'm missing a color here. Mm. 
<laughs> you know, one thing you can always look for is like if you sit there and you're just sitting there painting with it, does it feel like it's it's gonna fall over? You know, like does it feel like there's this big heavy weight just sitting here like pulling it down? You know, and I don't necessarily know if I ever actually get that right because, you know, we all, the fun thing is, the fun thing about, about art in general is anybody that's really an artist, you're kind of, you know, I feel like I'm being pretentious right now. I am. You could be too. We all are. Let's just put it that way. But... <clears throat> like I've been watching these videos talking about composition you know I have these lines here it's more like and it's not at all for any reason because I was going to do something where I was like going to paint a little put like a grid on here but it's like the part that I keep coming back to The whole point of art is to break the rules. What is it you're supposed to do? You know? I mean, I guess if you want to be conventional and do the other things, but and I'm sure that there are people that are really good at those things. You know? More contemporary, whatever. I think the best part is just go have some fun, right? Go have some fun. I don't know, what does that look like to you? What does that look like to you? Can I get a comment? Can you guys get a comment? Come on, come on. I think it's done. You think there's I don't know, it feels like there's something there. I feel like there's something there. Da 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 da. I don't know. I feel like I want to put a whole pile of paint on here. Sometimes I'll do this where I just like get to here. And then it's like, ah. I want to put more on there. I feel like there's something needs to go. Just bold 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 decision cotton see how that'll play out for him let me just, just load this brush up with a whole bunch of different colors on this canvas it's weird Ezealian red oh there we go So what do you guys, uh, I don't know if, if you're watching this, do you like pay attention to stuff that's other than just, I shouldn't say that's not the right way to put it. Do you care that Elon Musk bought Twitter? What's your opinion on that one? There's another question to you, to all you out there watching this. Part of being an artist is the freedom of expression, right? Shouldn't you be allowed to express yourself 
however you want. Now I know that there are some people that just feel like expressing themselves with all sorts of really stupid things. Like this. I think you gotta let them speak too. You know what the best part about letting stupid people talk? They tell you how stupid they are. It's better to let them speak. You go, wow, I don't want to listen to that guy. Turn his shit off. Do you have any steadfast rules when you're painting that you like to try to follow? Or break, for that matter? I am the masterpiece, I mean, Isn't that kind of the fun part? Isn't it kind of fun trying to just break, find the right rules to break that you can get away with? I've really been digging the tree thing. You guys will notice eventually you'll see a bunch of stuff. There will be a time when they, they look back at this period of my work and be like, man, that asshole painted a lot of trees. How's that look to y'all? Crazy. I don't know. I feel like there's there needs something in that little, just a little, just a little. So, how does that look to you? I kind of like that. I kind of like that. So, do you like it? Hit the like button. If you like this painting, hit the like button. If you don't like this painting, comment and tell me what you don't like about it. I'm curious. You know, I, I'm the arbiter of what I see, but maybe you see something different than I do. So, what do you think? If you like it, hit the subscribe button. Why don't you go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And you know that the link up there, the URL, copy that. And then go on to Twitter or Instagram or any of your social medias, Facebook, 
and share it with your friends and tell them, hey, this guy Ambalamps painted this cool painting with a red tree. I don't know what his deal is with trees, but it's kind of cool. Anyways, go out there and be the change you want to see in the world and have a fantastic day. Yeah.